My name is Sarah. Um, this is going to be my first official YouTube video. And I'm going to be doing a what I got for Christmas. Merry Christmas, by the way. Or happy holidays, whatever you celebrate. So I want to first start out by um, saying why I want to start making videos for YouTube. So like the past like year and a half, two years, uh, I've been just like constantly watching YouTube videos. Literally watch one like at least one before I go to bed. It just helps me like calm down and relax. And I just love like when people vlog and I love watching like hauls and I like watching like recipes that people make up. Just like all that stuff so I really want to get involved in the YouTube community and I love photography. I'm starting a business on the side so I really thought that this would complement the photography doing like making videos, videography maybe. So we'll see where this takes off to but I really appreciate all of your love and support if you guys are watching this and just so you guys know you're my first viewers so you all deserve a big hug like I'm hugging you guys right now thank you <laughs> so let's get into the haul the first thing that I got this is from my boyfriend Kevin I just helped him pick out a few things this year because he's having trouble finding stuff for me so he got me um, two necklaces the one I'm wearing it's like a little red uh, pinkish color and then the other one is like a minty color and one has a silver and one has gold change gold yeah, the other one has a gold chain, um, but I really like them a lot. They're really pretty and they're pretty like universal colors so they could go with a lot of outfits. The next thing that Kevin got me is a pair of Harry Potter pajama pants and I love Harry Potter. Love it so much. I'll be putting these on later to watch some of them and they're so soft and he got these from Target. This is the one thing he surprised me with so I really like these. The next thing that Kevin got me, this is actually an early birthday gift, but he wanted to give it to me um, when he gave me my Christmas gifts because my birthday is in January, so, and we might go like on a trip, so he got me snowboarding boots, and I got new ones because my old ones, they were like two sizes too big, so I needed a new pair, and then I also wanted ones that had like this little crank here that like tightens instead of the regular like, loose or the regular ties because those are always loosening and like coming apart on me. So I got these pairs. They're Head. That's the brand name if you guys are interested in these. I really like them. They have like fur inside. And they also got me this bag on Amazon. So another thing Kevin got me, this is for Christmas. He got me this marble looking case for my, uh, for my iPhone 6. I really love like the marble look now. So like my dad actually, I'll show you in a little bit, he got me a laptop case that matches this. Another thing that Kevin got me is this candle right here. Um, it's called Charmed Aroma. You buy the candle for $30 and then inside every candle you're guaranteed a ring anywhere from like $10 and I think the highest price goes up to $5,000. Obviously the $5,000 one's going to be like pretty rare to find in your candle. The bottom of the candle is where you find the ring so like eventually like I don't want to break myself. So like at the bottom of the um candle like once it like gets all melted you could take tweezers and like go to the bottom and there's like a little piece of tin foil and the rings inside of that. So I've been like burning it like crazy that way I could get to the ring. I just <laughs> I wanna see what's in it. You can't blame me. So I told Kevin about it and he was like shh shh and I was like, what? And I was like, did you get it for me? And he was like, shh. I was like, I'm sorry. So he was so mad because I like ruined it. Um, but I still give him props because he found it on his own. And he didn't need my help for it apparently. So props to Kevin for that. And then the last thing that Kevin got me is two mugs. But they're clear. How cool is this? And these we, ha we actually got these at the dollar store. So if you like these, go grab some for like a dollar. <laughs> They're pretty awesome. I just like them because like you could see through them. So when you're throwing like milk in your coffee or something, you could see it all mixed together and it looks really cool. And then complimenting this gift, my friend Teresa got me a T Tavana diffuser and she got me 
some jade citrus mint um, and it's like a green, green tea blend. It's, oh my god, it's so good. It has like, it doesn't have too much of a citrusy taste, but like it has a really, really good mint aftertaste. Just little like loose leaves and you pour like a tablespoon here and then you put it in the mug and then you pour the hot water in and it diffuses it into the mug. So it's really cool. You guys should try, you guys should try these out. My friend Carly got this game. It's called Drink a Palooza. And <laughs> this is definitely a game for if you're 21. Um, I wouldn't say anything if you're younger than 21, but definitely for um, an older crowd. It looks like Monopoly and like they have challenges if you land on like the ones with the beer bottles, red solo cup in the middle, and like every time you land on um, one of the pour in drink cup, you have to pour some of your drink in. And if everyone's <laughs> drinking different drinks, that could be pretty toxic. So um, and there's all these different component, like uh, different like things that you do with the game. I would recommend the game. We played it on our holiday party. So. It was a good time. <laughs> the next thing that I have, this is a, I actually got this for myself, just so I had like another gift to open under the tree. It's a shaker, so like you can make mixed drinks in it, and um, when you pour it out, the ice stays in the jar, so it just makes the drink cold after you shake it up. Um, so yeah, this is really cool. And then also going with the complimentary theme, my parents got me this. 12 global cocktail mixes or mixers and they're like all different kinds of cocktail drinks from all around the world they all look really really yummy and on the back they give you instructions for like mixed gin and vodka or whatever it may be so this is a really cool gift and I can use my shaker to make them <laughs> so as I mentioned before I have a matching laptop case so this is for my MacBook it's just a pretty marble and it's just white on the bottom but it's like it looks like it's pretty good quality the cell phone case and the laptop case they're both G actually I have the box so they're both the G M Y L E Gimmel and this is like the packaging that the case came the uh, iPhone case came in so yeah, if you guys want these, check them out. I think they sell them on Amazon, if I'm not mistaken. The next thing that I got is a Harishal black backpack. And I'm really, really excited about this because it's like the perfect size for like walking around and stuff. And I'm going to Europe in two weeks. So it, it's just perfect timing to get a backpack like this. I could fit my camera. I could fit like my cell phone, my wallet, you know, all of the like important essentials. It's a really nice backpack because it also has like this laptop case in the back. So, I use it for school too. And I just think it's really stylish because it has like this little cold zipper. And it's just, I like clean stuff. So, I really like this. You like hair shell. We got this off of Amazon. It was like cheaper on Amazon. So, and then I got these. These are Sperry's like version of the, of duck boots. And they're meant to be like kept loose like that. That's just like the style of them. They're like a navy and black. But like, they go really well with a pair of like dark jeans or like leggings or something. I love these and they're really good for if it rains. Next thing is a um, active wear jacket that my aunt and my uncle got me. So I really like this. This is actually Roxy brand um, and it has like this really cool like meshy like stretchy fabric all over it in the back and like it has it up here. I really like it a lot, so I'll like be wearing this for when I go rock climbing or if I'm going ice skating or when I go snowboarding and stuff like that. It's really nice. These are, <laughs> they cut, um, this one's for pineapples and this one is for corn. So I eat pineapple a lot, so like this actually pits the center of it and then it takes like all the pineapple out and like a swirl kind of like shape and then I guess you just cut it up from there I haven't used it yet but I always like when I'm at school I always get pineapples because it's so expensive to just get like the pre-cut kind so I get an actual pineapple for like two dollars less and you get more pineapple but I'm always cutting myself <laughs> so my mom didn't want me cutting myself anymore so she got me a pineapple slicer cutter thing 
And then the other one is for corn. So I never really grew out of the phase of like after you get your braces off, you start eating corn on the cob the regular way. I just, I just don't like doing it. So now I have my corn slicer, so I don't have to do it with a fork and a knife anymore. I'm excited about these too. It makes my kitchen life easier. The next few things I'm going to show you um, are some clothes. Um, most of these came from my, my mom and my stepdad. I lied, this is from my Pop Pop. This is like a really heavy knit sweater and it has a hood. I just thought it was really cute and like cozy. Wear like a tank top like this underneath. I just thought it was nice. My, my parents thought it was like kind of like grandparent-ish, but I like it. Oh well, who cares what people think? Just wear you. Wear you people. Last year for Christmas, I got um, like this really cheap pair of leather pants. So this year, I have a good pair of Express leather pants. And let me tell you, these things are super thick. Like, I'm probably gonna sweat in these if I don't wear them on like a really cold day. These are super cute. Um, I got two pajama pant shorts. I always am hot, so these are nice, especially in the summer. So I got these two, and these are from Old Navy, which I actually just started shopping at Old Navy. They have like really good basic kind of like clothing, and I never realized because I never went there before. But there's one right at, by my house, so it's new favorite store now. Next, I have um, bras from Aerie. I don't wear like regular bras anymore. I just don't think they're very comfortable, um, so I wear like bralettes all the time now. I'll probably wear this more in the summer because of like the cross stuff so you won't really see it in the winter so this would be better for like a tank top kind of day in the summer. This one is kind of confusing. It goes like, it goes like this, but this like wraps around the back, I don't, it's really hard to show you guys. It's like, it's like that when it's on but then this little strap in the back kind of like hangs lower on your back so like that would be what the back looks like oh, sorry <laughs> but this is like one of my favorites I already have one I think it, I have one in black and it's really comfy so these are awesome I would recommend bralettes instead I actually got another one but I'm wearing it or I wore it the other day so it's in my laundry so I don't want to show you a dirty one <laughs> next thing I got is this big fluffy robe. It's like a big gray fluffy robe. It doesn't go all the way to my feet because I don't like those because they kind of like make me hot. And as you know, I get really hot all the time. This is the last uh, piece of clothing that I got for Christmas. So I'm really excited about this. Um, <laughs> you'll see why. It's a huge winter jacket. It's huge. I'm like telling you it's huge. Like it's goes from like it's at my shoulders right now and it goes like to my knees like <laughs> it's such a long jacket but I love it because it's white first of all and I like white um, and it's also it has like the insulated inside and it's Calvin Klein so it's like pretty good quality we got it from Boscov's um, so it's like half off like the regular price it would be from Calvin Klein but I really, really like it. It has like the fur on the hood and I'm really excited to wear this around Europe when we go in two weeks. <laughs> this is a really neat thing that my mom got me for my stocking. It's called a tile and it's like this little white GPS tracker and you can stick it on your keys. So I put it on my like, car keys. So if I ever like lose my car keys, this is hooked up to an app on my phone, so I can just go on my um, my phone app, like any like regular GPS app, it'll lead me to like where my keys are if I lose them. And then it also works the other way, like in like a little button on it, in the E, um, you can like press the button and it'll make your phone like go off even if the sound is turned off. So that's really cool if you lose your phone, so it works both ways. So I really like this. The last like bigger item that I got was this book, um, it's called Creative Painting and Beyond. So like it has like all different kinds of like DIY kind of things in it and like they show you different ways to paint things. I might end up doing another video with like some of the DIYs in here so let me know if you guys want to see some of those. 
So that's everything that I got for my for my Christmas this year. And I'm so grateful for everything that I got and to have spent so much time with my family and my friends. Just remember it's not about the gifts, it's about spending time and being with the people that you love and appreciating them and it's about giving back. Like my favorite part is always giving and picking out gifts for other people to make them happy and um, it's just about spending time. That's all you could really ask for on the holiday. So I just want to tell you guys thank you for watching my video. This has been an awesome first video and I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, subscribe and like my video, whatever you want to do. If you want to follow me on social media, my Instagram is at Sarah Fitzy. And if you want to follow my photography page, it's at Sarah Fitz Photography. Love you guys. Thanks for watching.